Hello, welcome to Website Guider TV. In this video, I am going to show you how to you can create a typewriter effect in WordPress. As you can see on my monitor, the typewriter effect is going on here. It is a typewriter effect we are going to create. So what we need is a JavaScript plugin, named as TypeJS by Matt Bold. So I am searching it. Here it is, github madboot type.js, go there. And now you can see here are many files, the plugin files, these are the required files, but we don't need all of these, we need a main file, which is a type.minify.js, this is the file we require. We can also use this, but this is the minified version, so I am choosing this version. Now, I have to put this file into the themes folder so you have to go to your websites website this is your website then you have to go WP content themes the your theme then create a JS folder if your theme doesn't have one you have to create this folder so I have created this here it is JS then you can create the plugin then you can create sorry you can create file here named as uh, example.js and you can host to this file here so I have pasted the required file type.minify.js and also I need another file named as example.js I have created that now first of all we need to enqueue this type.minify.js so we will go to functions.php file there I have to enqueue it so I will enqueue it you have to follow each of these steps I request you to follow the steps carefully because a single mistake can make the web admin area of yours a wide screen. So please paste the code with here. Yeah. So this is the handle, I will call it type.js. And I will get the template direct to URI. Then I will concatenate it with JS typed dot minified dot JS. I want this plugin to be loaded after jQuery, so I am passing this argument. Another I will select to true. Then we have another file that is example.js. We had enqueue it also. So we will call it example. We will do the same of get template directory URI. Concatenate it with js example dot js. I want also this file be loaded after jQuery also set it to true then save it and the scripts will be enqueued and you will be able to use them so I have already enqueued this so I don't need this I want to show you how you can enqueue the scripts so this is the way you can encrypt the scripts so after saving the functions.php file we now have to create a HTML element where we will show the typing effect so I have already created it on the home page you can see it we do lots of step then just backspacing it back delaying start delay weak change ideas so I have targeted the I want to show the typewriter effect on the home page so here it is I am 
targeting it with the span ID so I can show you live this is here as you can check my laptop is little bit getting hanged so please don't here I am checking it so here it is yes now you can check it I have targeted the HTML element type which I will use in the example.js so here it is creating the things so we have created a example.js file so what we need to put it on so we have to create a variable so then we have to create a object type I already created this so I don't need to waste time so I will just copy and paste it here oh here it is so I am targeting the I am targeting the type of effect using the element here I am using the ID span ID so between this span the type effect will be created so here I am using that ID of the element span element so here it will be created these are the strings means the text you want to create type type writer text effect of so first uh, sentences change ideas then it is the another what I want to create the type effect of is change WordPress create WordPress themes create WordPress plugins do a lot of stuff so these sentence will be repeated these the effect of these sentences will be created another is types type speed this is the speed you want the the sentences to complete in the time span so means the typing speed of the sentences another is back speed back speed means the backspacing time of the text means when we cut the text on the using keyboard so uh, the time required to cut the backspace the sentence another is back delay means how many how many after time the sentence will be backspaced just like uh, it has created a sentence called to change ideas then how much time it will require to backspace it so I have uh, put the argument of 1000 seconds not 1000 is just one second start delay is means the time you want to start the effect from so when I reload the page after 1000 milliseconds the typing effect will start loop means whether you want to continuously repeat the sentences or not I have said true because I want the sentences to be repeated so here it is repeating the words so you have to save it and the, this effect will be created but you, you should remember that this h2 we span id type is important because I am referring to this to this span id by its id type so it is mandatory to use a division element so you have to do then css what you want just like i have set the bold here i have put the bold idea so that's why the change of this word is changing the background of it is changing so you can easily create this effect so this is our new theme for our website guide you can see this effect will be live there this is not a big deal to create such effect but I thought to give you a short video to tell not how you can create it I hope you liked the video thanks for watching please subscribe and comment